It's hard to imagine Knight Rider without Kit, Batman without the Batmobile, and Mad Max without his Interceptor. Some films and TV series have made their mark in history because of their impact in the industry or how they positively affected people's lives in general. In a number of instances, some movies and TV shows became popular and attached to their audience because of the four-wheeled machines lead characters drove around. A number of cars and films and TV shows have become icons in their own right, cultivating interest and passion among generations of TV and movie fans. Whether it's a fictional jalopy that defies time and space, or a bat-themed bulletproof beast on wheels, these cars have become the objects of desire for those who find themselves enamored with roadsters and sedans that made TV viewing and movie night more than just a memorable experience. Hello everyone, and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we'll tell you about the 10 most expensive cars you've seen in a film or a TV show. But first, make sure to subscribe to the channel for more similar content. Let's dive in. Number 10. DeLorean DMC-12 from Back to the Future Price $541,000 The car that sent Marty McFly on a time-traveling adventure, the DeLorean DMC-12, became an instant hit. Only seven of these models were built, one of which was sold at an auction in 2011 for $541,000. The proceeds went to the Michael J. Fox Foundation for Parkinson's Research, a nonprofit organization founded by Michael J. Fox, the actor who played McFly and is now suffering from this terrible disease. Number 9. Chitty Chitty Car from Chitty Chitty Bang Bang Price $805,000 the Chitty Chitty car may have just been a prop for a film titled Chitty Chitty Bang Bang, but it could be driven around. The musical star Dick Van Dyke as Karatikus Potts and Sally Ann Howes as Truly Scrumptious. The story revolves around Potts, his family, and his flying car called Chitty Chitty. The car was initially planned to be put on auction, but after a couple of failed attempts, arrangements were made and Chitty Chitty was sold for $805,000. Number 8. 1969 Shelby Mustang GT500 from Gone in 60 Seconds. Price $1 million. The main target of Grand Theft Auto expert Memphis Reigns, played by Nicolas Cage, in the film Gone in 60 Seconds, this 1969 Shelby Mustang GT500 is worth stealing although we condemn theft and any other criminal act. Under the beautifully designed American car exterior is a beautiful and powerful 400 horsepower engine. Nicknamed Eleanor, three of these cars were built for the film. Sadly, only one survived. It netted $1 million when it was sold in 2023. Number 7. 1929 Duesenberg Model J from Spin Out 1966 Price $1.2 million Classic car, classic movie, and a classic leading man make the 1929 Duesenberg Model J dual cow phaeton as a sought-after vehicle prop. Appearing in the 1966 movie Spin Out that stars music icon Elvis Presley, this car got a huge amount of screen time. After a successful restoration, the car was sold for more than $1.2 million at an auction in 2011. Number 6. Porsche 911 S from Le Mans Price $1.37 million. It is a mortal sin to discuss iconic cars in TV and films without including the legendary Steve McQueen, his Porsche 911 S, and the film Le Mans. In the 1971 movie Le Mans, McQueen was a natural behind the wheel of his Porsche 911 S during the opening scenes. Aside from being an actor, McQueen was also an amateur race car driver and had an extensive collection of classic roadsters and sports cars. His Porsche 911 S fetched over $1.37 million in an auction back in 2011. Number 5. Aston Martin DB5 from Goldfinger. Price $4.6 million. Cars and films? That means you have to include James Bond in the equation. And it is very fitting to rank the Aston Martin DB5 along with the other four-wheelers in this list. The car appeared in the 1964 James Bond movie Goldfinger, which stars the young and dashing Sean Connery. Only two were made for the film, the one gone forever after it was stolen, and the other now in display at Union Savings Bank's President Harry Yegi Private Museum. Number 4. Batmobile from Batman TV Series Price $4.62 million. Would this list be complete without the Batmobile? It is just plain wrong if not one of the many incarnations of the Batmobile does not make the cut. But one did, and it's from the classic TV series Batman that ran from 1966 to 1988. 
basically a redesigned and customized Ford Lincoln Futura, the Batmobile is perhaps the most popular TV car of all time. 47 years after the show ended, the car managed to bag $4.62 million at an auction in January 2023. Number 3. 1965 Shelby Cobra Daytona from Redline 7000 Price $7.25 million Another Steve McQueen car, this time a 1965 Shelby Cobra Dayton Coupe that appeared in the 1965 film Redline 7000. But more than being a McQueen's car, this classic racer has another claim to fame, being the only American car to beat a Ferrari in a race. Like any other car from McQueen's collection placed in auction, the 1965 Shelby Cobra Daytona Coupe bagged a fortune, but the final price of $7.25 million blew everyone away. Number 2. 1961 Ferrari 250 GT from Ferris Bueller's Day Off Price $10.9 million Ferris Bueller's Day Off may seem to be an ordinary film reflecting teenager angst and teen rebellion, but it proved to be a commercial and influential hit, delving on the story of Ferris Bueller, Matthew Broderick, and his best friend Cameron, Alan Ruck, and girlfriend Sloan, Mia Sarah. The film's car also became an icon. In 2008, the 1961 Ferrari 250 GT California Spider used in the movie was bought by radio personality Chris Evans, who had to shell out $10.9 million for the car. Number 1. 1968 Ford GT40 Golf from Le Mans Price $11 million the ultimate iconic car in a film or TV, Steve McQueen's 1968 Ford GT40 Golf or Mirage Lightweight Racer is a sight to behold. Driven by the actor during the filming of Le Mans in 1971, this racer was only given a few moments in the movie, but despite the very short exposure, the car easily captured the hearts and minds of moviegoers and car enthusiasts alike. It was an actual race car that participated in the 1968 Le Mans Endurance Race and Daytona. The $11 million price tag for the car is now a record, the biggest amount ever spent on an American car. That was all from us today, folks. For more similar content, make sure to subscribe to the channel. See you in the next one.